It's your girl, Shelly Shell, not your average girl. Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your girl, Shelly Shell, not the average girl. It's 4 o'clock in the morning, and I woke up like this. I woke up like this with a lot of dreams, a lot of visions, a lot of thoughts of the future of an entrepreneur. I got laid off about four months ago. I went back for a couple of days. We had a couple of differences and now it seems that, hey, I'm laid off again. And God told me to pursue my dreams, but it's okay because God is telling me that I have a future. I can pursue my dreams and my visions of single on a Saturday night, the talk show, the magazine, the boot camp. I was an entrepreneur for 15 years doing urban expressions. Uh, it's been a long journey. I enjoy it. I never thought I was going to be an employee for long, but it was a good experience working for, you know, working, doing marketing for other people other than myself. But when you pursue your dreams, sometimes you wake up with thoughts and all these types of what's going to happen next. Where's the money coming from? So it's four o'clock in the morning and I have all these thoughts. So I wanted to talk to you. I know there's a lot of entrepreneurs that can identify with what I'm going through, but I know we're going to all make it because there's enough money out here for everybody. And I'm not doing this for the money. I'm doing this because there's a lot to be done. There's a lot to talk about. There's a lot to show people and teach people about being an entrepreneur. This is my second time around and I'm ready. And I'm ready for success. I'm ready. So yeah, I woke up like this. I'm ready. Scarf on my head, glasses on. I'm ready. But I woke up ready to tackle the world of being an entrepreneur. Thank you, God, for all your visions. Thank you for all that you're doing for me. I appreciate you, Lord. To more success. Thank you.